You work here at this wireless store. Is you own this wireless store? Yes. But you're also a volunteer firefighter. So what did you see or what did you hear that made you come out and were able to respond? I just had a customer inside that said a guy just got hit by a car and ran outside and started giving emergency medical care. What kinds of things did you have to do? Uh, mainly just make sure he's alert and conscious and breathing okay and basic vital signs and just stay there until uh, EMS arrived. And uh, I mean, w as far as what you could tell, I mean, was how bad was the impact or anything like that? Was there anything you could speculate on that? Or? He was in the crosswalk and got hit by the car and bounced a couple times. Okay. Um, and as far as for EMS and police and fire, I mean, what do they tell you about being able to respond and everything? Nothing. I mean, that's, this is what we do. You know, it's it's not anything big. Anybody else would have done the same thing. You know, if somebody's down and, and needs help, you're going to help them. Well, have you, this intersection being pretty busy, sandy and whatnot, I mean, do you see anything like this often or anything at all? We see accidents every once in a while, but typically not people in the crosswalk. I mean, it's a pretty busy area and, you know, most of the time people are alert. So, like, again, I didn't see what happened, so I don't know what the circumstances are. And you said you did hear some people screaming and whatnot? Or? Yeah. Okay. Um, now, as far as you were making a response, how long have you been a firefighter? You've seen things like this before? About 10 years. So you've seen things like this before? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Hey, thanks, Mike. You bet.